Hey, it's Lavender Rose. We are going to the greenhouse today and check it out and check the gardens out. Got the soaker hoses planted in there. Some of it's good, some not. <laughs> we'll check it all out today though, but come on with me. Let's get busy. Got our coffee. Ah. Always gotta have your coffee. Mm. That's some good stuff. It's cooler today. It got down to like 50 something, maybe 40 something. I don't know it was cold, but it doesn't seem like it hurt. I got one plant back there. I don't think it's going to survive maybe two because when I was doing the hose, I think I clipped their, some of the roots, but I've got more in the greenhouse I can replant, so it's not a big deal. But as you can see, the sucker hoses are planted in there. Um, it was a bit of a deal, but I got it done. Oh, well. All right. So over here, I've got one or two plants that's not going to be able to get to the um, sucker hose, and I'm going to have to water. Probably these right here. Uh, but you can see where I put the soaker hose in, which was fine. I've got to redo, put some more on it. Uh, they're looking really good. We had a really cool night last night and it didn't seem to bother anything. But you can see where my, that's where I, the blue thing is. That's where I hooked my hose up to, to the soaker hose. And I let it run. I let it run for like half an hour, I think it was. You hear the stupid squirrels fuss and they're going to get in trouble. What in the world? <laughs> I just noted somebody come in here somehow and turned around or something. I don't know what they were doing. Don't know who it was. Huh. Interesting. Uh, things you see when you come outside, right? Y'all need to go on. Get. You can't have my seeds. Go. They're for the birds. Go on. He's up my bird buds. Go on, get. Oh, well, anyway. <laughs> Let's go to the greenhouse and see if we can find a wasp again. Those are so pretty. I don't know uh, quite what they are, but if you get really close on it, it's like fuzzy. It's fuzzy purple stuff in there. And the mine probably will show blue, but it's purple. Um, this camera always shows purple as blue, and I don't know why, but it does. <laughs> All right, I'm almost afraid to open it up. <laughs> All right, shall we go in? Ooh, the rose is opening up more. Okay, come on, people, let's go in. Let's be brave. Come on, brave. <laughs> We're brave enough soldiers. Come on in here. And you say, oh, <laughs> I'm sorry. I saw that and I was going, oh, what's the thing? Uh, I'm going to be jumping while I'm in here. I'm sorry, I won't let you know that. You're going to hear a lot of screaming and hollering and who knows what all else is going on if he gets after me again. <laughs> you just are. I'm sorry. It's going to happen. Look at the rose. Oh, isn't it so pretty? I love roses. I think roses are one of my favorite things. And I want to get these things out, but the weather just hasn't opened up enough yet to do it. So, I guess he's the only one that's got a bud. This one's supposed to be an orange a coral and I can't wait for it to grow but it does it's not looking really good <sighs> they need to be out I think oh well I don't know but that is so pretty I wonder if it smells yet not yet I ordered uh, roses that's supposed to be fragrant because that one doesn't smell good I still have some tomatoes to replace my other tomatoes with. I have tomatoes in uh, containers that I can put outside. You're looking really good, aren't you? You're pretty. Um, <laughs> yes, I talk to my plants. People are going, oh, she's crazy. She talks to her plants. But you know what? The plants love you talking to them. Let me put my cup up there. I am trying to get some of the old-fashioned... The old-fashioned uh, primrose to grow and these are supposed to be the seeds but they are just not not doing anything I had a few to come up a couple of them where are they at right there and uh, that was all that came up and I'm not even sure that they're it but I'm hoping they are um, let's see what was that down here oh nice oh yeah they are I start to say there's 
I can't get around it without touching the rose. Let me see what they are. These are the uh, the jumbo cantaloupes. I have not got any of these planted out, I don't think. Uh, that something's going to have to happen. I've got to get that going, get those out there too. I've got plenty of rooms, so there's not a problem. Um, anyway, uh, let's see. This was sugar babies. I got some of those planted outside. These are the black diamonds. I've got a couple of those. I saved a few in just in case. In case frost did hit, and I can't cover everything. And um, so I saved a few. We really need to get these these out planted. Yep, they're getting really. Let's take those out. Oh, we got a watermelon in there too. I mean, watermelon. A uh, what do you call it? Look at that one. That cantaloupe's just like cantaloupe um, cucumber. But I want to wait. I want to be sure that those do not get. Uh, ew, we're gonna get wet here. So they do not get. Um, you know, frost bit. I want to make sure that I keep some for that. Let's go out here and plant these real quick. It won't take us but a minute or two. Hey, birdies. And I want these. This is the idea. And you tell me if you think you're going to like it or not. I want them to grow back here at the back on these little trellis things. I just think that would be awesomely pretty if they would. Um, so, what we're going to do, I'm going to set you down and we're going to see if we can get a couple of these out of here and see if we can get them started because of uh, set sand so dry there. Wow. Maybe I can put it here. Feels good and warm though because it's out in the sun. And I'll have to water these too now. Um, let's see. I got two here together. See if I can separate them. And uh, let's see if we can put it. Be nice if a sucker hose could give them some water, but I'm not sure that it can. But uh, we're gonna plant that one there, and uh, I'm gonna move over here a little bit. Uh, and we're gonna see if we can. That tomato's not looking good because I had to come right through here, and when I did, it got it really, really close. Um, too close, it clipped the. Uh, The little, uh, oh, uh, the little, the little vines are right here. Since this is already not looking very good, and there's some grass that's got to go. Ah, come on, grass, you gotta go. Let's see. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna plant him right here, and I uh, hope he survives. And let's see, anything else? Got two more right here. We're gonna go down there, Father. So come with me. Uh, we will put those back in the greenhouse. I'll take them for next year. Uh, I want some all along this wall. I think it'd be very, very pretty if I could just get it to grow. I've got these ropes up here because I have a little four-year-old grandchild who don't understand. Don't step in the garden. Um, <laughs> she just does it. Uh, so anyway. There we go. All right, now I'm gonna have to water them because they'll not survive. Too much leaves, not enough dirt on him. If I can get them to grow there, I can get them to run up there. That's what I'm thinking anyway. Um, I'm gonna step on. So, there we go. We got some other morning glories. And those are blue morning glories, so they're gonna be really pretty. And I've got some other colors that I can mix in there too. I think it'll look really pretty and have it just growing up there and covering that up and having beautiful flowers on it. Let's see. Oh, here's the hose. Let me just cut it on real quick. I'll just water those that we uh, just planted. I'm loving this thing here. Like I said, this is really, really nice. You gotta turn your water on first, silly. But you can control how much water's coming out of that instead of it just everywhere. So, uh, it really does help. And normally I would have on the little sprayer thing, but since we're just, I'm just gonna do this number with it and hope I don't knock them down. 
just okay. So we got those planted. Let's go back into the greenhouse again. Oh. Should have washed my hands while I was there too, shouldn't I? <laughs> anyway, those beautiful palms are so pretty. And we have little lizards. It's just adorable. I said, put a picture on there, I think, of the lizards. Oh, he was so trying to impress her. I'm afraid to come back in here again. Uh, those are those lilies. They need to be outside too, and I can't get them out. Not yet. Uh, this might be our cold snap. I hope so. A lot of times it's like on uh, Easter where we get our cold snap from. And um, I don't know. You need to be out there where you can get some. Okay, so I've got a lot more planning I can do. Still got another kind of cool night tonight. I think or a couple of them, so I'm waiting before I plant anything else. Got all kinds of flowers I need to get in some pots and just all kinds of things to do. But I want to thank you for coming to the greenhouse with me. And we'll keep watching the rose open. Isn't it so pretty that I love that? That one's just going to be a red one. I think that, let me see what the name of it was. That was uh, Europeana. That was Europeana. And it may have clusters. I don't know. But right now it's only got the one up there. I'm glad to see it. But a lot of these things, it's just not doing good. Uh, they really need to be outside. Let me get the sun and whatever, but it's just too cold yet. It's just too cold. I can't do it. And these little darlings need to be getting outside too. So anyway, that's about it for the garden. Um, oh, something touched me and I jumped again. I'm telling you. Uh, I am nervous, just nervous, nervous, nervous uh, to be in here. I'm hoping he went out since I left the door open yesterday so he could. And I hit this poor little thing and he fell over. Hit it with a hose, but uh, since it's planted, it should put out more stuff, so it'll be all right. Let's get our coffee cup. So, uh, I guess this is it. And here's our froggy sitting in here. Uh, it's not quite warm enough for the frogs. I love it down here because whenever the frogs, whenever it rains, the frogs come out. It's so warm in here. It's so nice. Uh, the frogs come out and um, all of them start chirping at the whole same time. It's just amazing. You have this chorus of frogs just singing, singing. I've got so many of those I've got to put out. Uh, those, some of them was the early girl hybrids. And uh, I've got so many that needs to go summers, but uh, if I have to, I'll just stick them on top of each other almost and just let them go. I'm still not sure about the staking them. These just, this one's looking really good. It had some bad leaves where I took it out whenever I replanted it out there into these big pots. Uh, it had some like burnt leaves kind of like that on there. That one I didn't get clipped. Uh, and... Let's see, this stuff is going to be here for right now, sorry. Uh, these were the large pumpkins, and as you can see, they never did. They tried really hard, but they never did germinate. So, I just don't know. I don't know why they didn't. I'm going to put it back in there like that. This one here, see, it's the same thing. It looks like it tried to germinate, but it's just not doing it. So I don't know, maybe it's still too cold. I don't know, but it's just not doing it. Anyway, uh, so yeah, the tomatoes are doing good. Uh, let me set him out. I gotta have two hands for this. Where can you sit? <laughs> can you sit there for a minute? Yes, you can sit there. All right, let me see if I can get this one guess not. Great. All these things are so heavy you can't hardly do them one-handed. Oh. There we go. Well, remember the pumpkins that weren't growing? Yeah, well, they just got shifted out. Okay. So, ouch. Rose, uh, see, so things do go wrong in my garden. And if they go wrong, oh well, they just go wrong. I try not to be so overly uh, upset. Well, I've lost the seed to that one. wonder where it went. I've got one of the seeds, as you can see. And I may have should have uh, 
Maybe just put it in some water. I'm going to lay it on top of the ground see if it'll just barely cover it up. This one, I think, got lost. <laughs> I've lost my uh, pumpkin seed. Oh, no. I wonder where in the devil it went. Because I'm not seeing There it is. I'm going to start saying I'm not seeing it. I don't think I'm sure it goes. I'm not seeing it anywhere, you know, but... Alright, there we go. I'm sorry you were sitting there watching all everything else. Hands are dirty. I'm happy when my hands are dirty. Um, because that means I've been out in the garden working. Uh, okay, this is uh, Lavender Rose. Lavender Rose is gardening. And um, uh, please like, subscribe, uh, click that bell so you can see them every uh, Wednesday and Saturday. I will do a garden, so look for a uh, gardening thing, so be sure and look for it then. Uh, that way you'll know when it's coming on, you won't miss it. And if you click the bell, they'll send you a notification anyway. Okay, so thank you for watching. Uh, comments are always welcomed. Um, I know, uh, what was it, Northern Susie from, uh, I think she's from Michigan. She's still got like three foot of snow. I don't see how they stand it, I really don't. Uh, so this is for you, all the green. Matter of fact, I will send you a little extra look at the rose. There you go. Maybe that'll brighten your day some with all that snow. All right, I'm going to say bye for now. Come back to see me anytime. Love having y'all. Love your comments. And uh, be sure and stay tuned because you never know what's going to happen. Like I say, there was a, a wasp on the boobs the other day. And it was just like, oh my gosh. Anyway, so come back to see me. And uh, uh, have a great day. Try to do something fun. Just enjoy yourself. Have some fun. And come back to see me. Bye for Lavender Rose.